Hey, ladies and gentlemen. So, uh, I spent all morning. Uh, I got up at 5 o'clock this morning, couldn't sleep. I got two hats on. It looks crazy, but uh, one hat wasn't blocking the wind, so I got two. And uh, it got cold out here. Anywho, so yesterday after I made yesterday's video, uh, I pulled over in Boulder, Montana, which is between Helena and Butte, Montana on 15 to get fuel. And as I was pulling over, I looked over at the load board and saw this load. load. It was in Great Falls where I had just left 103 miles before. And uh, I called on it. Nobody answered, so I figured I missed the load. I got on over to the fuel island and was putting my fuel card in and ring, ring, ring. And so I turned around and answered it, and it was the broker. So I booked this load here, ladies and gentlemen. Let's show it to you. I know that uh, that setting there doesn't it doesn't have good focus on it. So. So what I have here is uh, at the airport, they're uh, going to put all these together and they're going to be like one choo-choo train. Uh, and uh, they're going to uh, throw luggage on those and pull them. And so that's what they are. And uh, it was very disorganized. I got over there. They were supposed to all be there at 9 o'clock got there at 9 or I got there at 8.30 nobody got there the tow truck didn't get there that's what they were loading it with big uh, tow truck semi tow truck and they loaded it with that with the big boom and it was so unorganized the guy got there I can't remember it was 10.30 nearly 11 o'clock I just finished up it's 3.30 it's 3.30 so of course, I don't get. I didn't get paid for any of that. Helping them, uh, had to put all these together. They were all just laying out in the snow. Put them all together. Putting all these. Uh, I don't mean from scratch, but from putting these. Uh, had to put these poles in right here. Had to put those in. They don't look like much, but it's a pain out in the snow because everything's buried in the snow. And then I had to uh, take these apart. Just try to put bungees on them. And then uh, had to, uh, we stacked the first set, two, and then two. Or no, then uh, two, and then three, and the four. We, and we got those all stacked on. And then these, this set over here, we did them one by one. And uh, it took, well, I, like I said, he got there uh, 10, 30, 11 o'clock. We got started, and I just now finished up, and it's 3.30. So that's how long it took, and that's with three guys. So... Um, there it is. That's my load, and it's going to Fort Worth, Texas, and it delivers on Monday. It's uh, uh, 15, 15, 1,600 miles, depending on which direction you take. And uh, so I'm tired. I've been up, like I said, early this morning, and uh, I'm going to uh, get something to eat and. Uh, Get something to eat, let my body warm back up, get some of these warm clothes off, and uh, I don't know if I'll head out of here. I'll probably head out of here tonight. It's been snowing all day. It has us nonstop. It's been snowing ever since I got here. Uh, the day before yesterday. And the funny thing is, they were all telling me, it didn't start snowing until you got here. <laughs> uh, well, it's not like it's my fault or anything, so... Anyway, it is what it is, and uh, so yeah, I'll get this uh, done and get it down there and get it off the truck, and then I'll look for a load. I'll be closer about 800 miles from the house, see if I can work on getting a load towards the house, getting that uh, wobbly tire changed. It's a hand cook, and no, it didn't do that before I had that tire on there. Uh, so the, the mate to the tire that's on there, the steers because I usually buy them by a set but that 
the driver's side, it's perfect, nothing wrong with it. But the passenger side, I let it get a little low on air and it got little divots, you know, uh, in the center of it, little low spots. And uh, it started thumping a little bit and I didn't like that, so I bought another tire. Well, the tire, ever since I, uh, that very same day that I put it on, now it's got a wobble, 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 wobble. <laughs> and so, I called him and told him about it, and of course, you know, I'm all the way across the country, so nothing negative about it. But, so, now get back, we'll get that taken care of. I'll take that fender off and and get it fixed. Of course, if you fix this, it's going to look new, so I might as well take the other one off and redo it too. So, get those taken care of and fix whatever else that I need to fix, and and so uh, we'll make sure we get that on the channel, ladies and gentlemen. So, and that's what's going on. Loaded in uh, Great Falls, Montana, and going to Fort Worth, Texas. And it don't pay very good, but uh, I was gonna have to deadhead 600 or something miles anyway to Salt Lake City and get a dollar fifty a mile low getting out of there. So, you know, it is what it is. I'll deliver this on Monday. You should clear around uh, 1,000 to 1,100, and then I'll look for a load. Uh, 50 cent low going out of Texas probably. <laughs> it's probably what it'd be by the time I get there. It seems like it's going cheaper and cheaper every day, but anyway. Anyway, it is what it is. Uh, what can you do? So anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that's what's going on with me. You guys have a wonderful day. Have lots of fun wherever you are. God bless. Don't be like me. <laughs> and later.